And just like that, the next episode has begun. Welcome back to Tales of Vesperia. I'm your host, Mike Shadow. If it's sick of it, you can stick a commentary. And this has the potential of being the final episode of the recording session I, of, of the game. I have no freaking... Oh, not the final episode of the game, because I still have the bonus episodes to do, but the final episode of the main series, anyway. It, it has the potential of being. I have no way of knowing. I don't really know how much of the dungeon I have left. I, I re... I reckon, as because I'm a lot of heart, I, I imagine that I still have quite a bit of uh, the dungeon left to do. I imagine that the blue save station was probably symbolizing the halfway mark, maybe, or maybe they're trying to do a freaking pool of bellius on us and have like the blue station, blue save station, like 20 minutes before the boss, before you actually fight the boss, and then if you lose, you have to like go through 20 minutes worth of progress all over again, or something like that, maybe. Jeez, this blue save station's make blue save station made us OP as crap. We shouldn't let this go over our heads and get over our heads indeed. Okay, um, nothing here. I was I wanted to see if I could actually like just walk onto the roof that roof over there because that that part of the roof kind of looked like I could walk on it. I don't know. Yeah, just making stuff up. Let's fight you! Tack 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 in the power of Juju. Is that is that how the open is that how the theme song went for the Attack and the Power of Juju like uh, TV show that was on Nicktoons Network? Or actually it was on Nickelodeon first, but then they switched to Nicktoons Network. Now they don't even show it at all. Based off of the video games, there's Attack and the Power. Of, I actually own one of them. Um, I'd have to pull out my freaking Xbox console to see it. I never beat it because it was too hard for me for some reason. I don't know why. I believe they made, it was like Attack the Power of Juju and this like Attack to this the the the, 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 the Staff of Dreams or something like that. And then there's the third one, just the one that I have. It's like the Attack Arena or whatever, whatever the hell it's called. I could pull out my games right now and look at it, but that's too much work. All right, here we go. Yay. Nothing over here. That doesn't look like. All righty then. Let's go ahead and... Hmm. Am I going in a circle? No, I'm not. This just looks exa exactly the same as the previous area, I think. All right, let's fight the giant Manti. Luna Nando, Luna Mondo. I don't know where I was going with that. When do I ever? That's that's one of those things. Actually, one thing I actually noticed relatively recently is like sometimes, whenever I don't know what to say, sometimes I'll just like randomly just break off into like an evil laugh. I'll be like, anyway, <laughs> stuff like that. I never realized how often I do that, like, <laughs> it's just one of those, I don't intentionally do it on purpose, it's just something that I do, I suppose. Whatever the case would be, mm, fight, 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 there we go. Come on, fight! Let's eliminate them. I will eliminate you all, Moonlight Navic. Remember when that, remember the hit song from the 1970s? Moonlight Navic, it was a, it was a hit. I should know because I was definitely alive during the 1970s. Maybe I was. Maybe, for all you know, I could actually be 47 and I could just be lying about not being 19 years old. I I could be for all you know. How would that make you feel if I was 47 years old? <laughs> oh jeez, that would be interesting. I mean, depending on when you're watching this, I actually could be 47. I'm 19 at least at the time of recording this, but. I never mentioned this. Like I keep, I've been wanting to say this since like freaking Sonic Adventure or something like that. But you know, it's like making Let's Play videos is like it's like a form of time traveling. It kind of is in a way, you know, because you're recorded on one day, but you know the recordings, the recordings at least for me anyway, they always go live like at least a day or two. You know, at least at the very least a day after it was recorded. And they don't just and they and they don't just stay live right after you upload it. Like they stay live essentially forever, essentially anyway. So, you know, we'll destroy them in, no time. in a way, when you watch videos, it's a way. This is like a way of like archiving, archiving stuff, man. Like I'm not just I'm not just archiving my voice. I'm archiving like my gameplay footage and everything as well. It's kind of like it's kind of weird in a way sometimes. Like. When I take the time to realize that I'm actually, like, whenever, sometimes, I don't really do this very often because, you know, I have other things to do, especially, you know, but, like, 
I, I mean, like, I pre- I pre- I always preview my videos, like, all- I watch my videos all the way through whenever I'm editing. So, like, if you're like, oh my god, this video is boring. You know, I had to- not only did I have to record it, but I had to sit through it, too, so, you know. You're not the only people suffering. It's very rare that I- I don't think I've ever gotten a comment like that. Usually, like, if anyone says anything mean, it'll be like, oh, you're freaking stupid. You make, like, the worst videos in the world, go kill yourself. Not, oh my god, this is boring. Uh, Elemental Ribbon, nope. What about... No. So, I guess that confirms that all three girls can actually use ribbons. It's just that some can only use select ribbons. Mm -hmm. No, that's a terrible drop in physical defense, actually. Who takes... No. Oh, well, I mean, she only drops by, like, 40. Oh. You know, and it, and it, has, and it has resistance to stuff, too. Maybe I should get that now. Whatever. Whatever it gets to be, but it's like... But sometimes I'll, like, see, like, some of my, like, older videos, right? And, like, it's so weird, like, when you take the time to realize that that's you! Like, not just your voice, but, like, it's your gameplay and... I'm gonna go back to the blue save station real quick, okay? Because this, this is screaming, this is screaming, you better freaking save or else you're going to get the poop kicked out of you in, like, all of negative five seconds. Because... Duke is probably at the end of that hallway. I mean, you could tell the music was different and everything. Like, no. I'm not taking any risks, ladies and gentlemen. Like, no, 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 no siree. Come on, let's do this. Ugh, but like, like, it's just, like, that's you. Like, not just your voice, but like your gameplay and everything. Like, maybe, maybe I'm like, just weird for like, I mean, like, it's like, you know it's you, but I don't know. It's, it's just kind of weird in a way. And, you know, just watching videos that are, like, especially, like, a year old or something, and seeing, like, um, you know, how much, like, you know, like, catchphrases that I say in my older videos that I still say, catchphrases that I've sort of gotten rid of. Like, I used to say, because YOLO all the time in my videos, but I stopped doing that quite some time ago. Um... Or is I going with this? But, you know, and then, and then, you know, just, and then, like... Uh, I don't know. It's just—it's just weird. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm just. Uh, Ju Ju Judith, Rita, Ludith, Mudith, Rita, Ludith. I don't know where I'm going with this, but Rita's and this has been turned into stone. So, don't punch me, you freaking hysteric purple. That's—that's that's a pretty awesome name, by the way. That sounds like a—that sounds like a uh, like a 1990s. That sounds like 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 a 1990s like thrash band. Hysteric purple. It probably is a band, for all I know. <laughs> I, I doubt that it would be a band, though, because if it was a band, then, um... At least in the U.S., anyway, they wouldn't be called Hysteric Purple in the game, unless, like, it became a band after this, which is always a possibility. Alright, let's go up. We're not gonna... F if Even if enemies have respawned, we're not gonna fight them, because we wanna have... We wanna be in full tip-top shape. By the way, how many life bells do we have? Uh, okay, we have at least 10, that's good. We're probably all, we still have five apple gels, but we still have lemon gels, orange gels, pineapple gels, miracle gels, and everything else, everyone's stocked up and everything. All right, if this is the final boss, I'm scared. <laughs> all righty then. Look at this, man. This is, this is freaking creepy. Like, you guys, what the heck? Who are you? I don't want to go near you. I'm scared. All right, is that Duke? I think that's Duke. You know how I hate waiting, Yuri Lowell. What the heck? And where do you think you're going with me right here? I knew it! I knew we were gonna have to fight Zoggy here. I knew it! You're alive. Don't you ever die? You just never quit. How many times do I have to tell you? I don't want anything to do with you. You're trying to save the world? <laughs> Well, the world will go bye-bye if you don't hurry, is that it? If you know that much, then don't get in our way! Oh, no, 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 no! That's what gives it so much meaning! What's this guy talking about? Look! There's a seal further on. If you want to get by, you have to take this arm from my body. You bastard! <laughs> Yuri! If you want to save the world, then you have to go through me. Why? Why are you 
you doing something so meaningless? 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 Oh, but it does mean something. This way, you'll fight with everything you've got. Zoggy, I never thought you were this crazy. Fine. Let's finish this. <laughs> Show me your anger, your rage! Give me everything you've got! Because if you don't, you won't get any higher! All right, I hope he doesn't kick our butts. <laughs> die, 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 die. I'm going to be quiet for like the pre-battle banter that they usually have. Uh, we're going to use a magic lens on you. Please? Are you going to keep chasing us? Resistant to nothing, weak to nothing, all I really care about really is the same exact level as us. Oh no, this is no good. I will hunt you down. Like you still can. You ever heard of all bark, no bite? Mm, yeah. Come on, give me everything you've got. We'll do whatever it takes. Okay, looks like their battle is over. Okay, so we're the same exact level as him, which makes me really nervous for. I think we should still be able to beat him, but I'm just really nervous for the final boss. The final boss. Because, like, if we're the same level as Zoggy, what is Duke going to be? He's going to be, like, especially once we get to, like, because he's going to have multiple forms. So, like, what is? what if he's, like, whoa! Goodness! I don't know why I reacted like that. Level 4 overlimit, by the way. Time to just start killing the crap out of you. Please? Please, this is a waste of an overlimit, isn't it? Okay, Dragon Upper. Punishing Beast Splash. Well, come on, Ultra Dart! No, I didn't get a chance to. Oh, well, who cares? Dragon Upper! Lagging Lupper! Alright, now it's time to beat you up the old fashioned way again. Ugh, goodness, man. Like, like, Duke is probably gonna be like level like 80,000. I know some, I believe someone said that. They, what were. What was. What were his levels? I forget. I believe he said he was like level 49 when he beat the game. He did like a low level run with his friends. Um, because they just started avoiding enemies and all their experience just came from, like, uh, boss fights. So they're like, well, so it is possible to beat Duke at level 49. I mean, it would be very hard, but I think we, so that means that we can definitely beat, how close are you two? He has blue, green, and red. All right, so I'm going to go with green. So, destructive pain shot, please. Okay. Oh, Judy got the blue. Can I get the green, please? Okay, Destructo... Dest I want to get a Fatal Strike on you, man! Destructo Pain... Okay, whatever, who cares? If we get a green Fatal Strike, we get a green Fatal Strike. I'm not going to focus that. I just want to beat you up, man. Oh, Caprice of Innocent Waters! Champagne! Destructo Pain Shot, by the way? Okay, I thought that since he was being attacked, that would have been the perfect time to do it, but I guess not. Okay, you're not even dead yet, man. Oh, crap, he's an overlimit! Okay, this is my time to run away before he does, like, some super OP, like, mystic art. Stop, 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 please, Zoggy. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone, man. I am not in the mood to get Mystic Arted in. Ugh. Okay, his Mystic Art is... Okay, his Overlimit's over. Ugh. If I was left... The only way I'm gonna... It's, I, was, I was told a long time ago to not go for bosses when they're in Overlimit unless you're in level 3 or 4 Overlimit. And... Whoa, let me get a nice recovery smash, please. Nice recovery smash, please. Nice recovery smash, please. There we go. I still hit, did recover at the same exact time. Oh, and I'm stunned again. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Zoggy is really, really enjoying this fight, man. I had a feeling we were going to see Zoggy here. I was, I had a feeling, like, I didn't know, I didn't know that we were going to fight him, but I just, I just knew it, like, Zoggy getting killed and freaking Bactian, like, that, that, no, you can't kill Zoggy like that. Only we have the ability to kill Zoggy, like, that would have been too anticlimactic of a death in order to kill him. Wait a minute. Are we going to fight Barbos here too? I wonder. What if, what if, and if the final boss, hmm, this is crazy. There's no way we're going to beat, there is no way we're going to beat the game in this recording session. Probably, the next recording session is probably going to be like two episodes, maybe, maybe, I don't know. And that next recording session should probably be... It's probably just going to be like boss rush, boss rush mode or something where I'm just going to fight like a bunch of bosses or something. Because we... I mean, we still have 20 minutes left. Oh, crap! Mystic Art! 
He's gonna kill us. He is going to kill us. Oh, he didn't hit me. He didn't hit me. I'm busy being... Oh, he did hit me a little bit. Oh, that didn't do shit! Okay, okay, I was nervous for a second. We're gonna have Estelle, we're gonna have Rita use an Apple Gel, because she kind of def desperately needs it. Then we're gonna give Estelle... We're gonna give Estelle, have her use, and uh, we're gonna have you use an orange gel. And then we're gonna have her use Nightingale. That's it, I'm dead. Okay. Okay, Rita just died. I'm gonna use a life bottle on her. Okay, so that Mr. Guard wasn't nearly. It was. It definitely wasn't Duke level. What are you gonna do? Oh, she's gonna use. Hey, Estelle, let's use something useful. You know, like, uh. I knew she was gonna do it. Nightingale, please. She, she just got hit, so I think that might have canceled her. Please? 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 Oh, yes. Grand is your favor. Nightingale, thank you. That's great. Now let's beat. How close are you to. Oh, yeah, he's, he's almost dead. I'm almost dead. I'm almost dead. I'm almost dead to the world. People don't like pests. Stop bothering us. Oh my goodness, 25,000 EXP, goodness. All right, you did your thing, Zoggy. That's enough of you. Level up. Level up. Level up. Level up. It doesn't hurt. It doesn't hurt at all. I can't move. What a weak body. I should change my next body to a Brastia too. That would be more fun. Right, Yuri? <laughs> Do it in hell. Sayonara. Roger, Craig Smith. No one understood him, so he put so much meaning on fighting. Poor thing. Still, his skills made him pretty famous. Something happened after he met you all. He really looked like he enjoyed fighting. Maybe he thought that he could let loose with everything when he fought Yuri. So Yuri was the only person he could do that with? What do I care about somebody that crazy? The downfall of someone with too much power. <sighs> We've wasted too much time on this. Let's go. Judy? Okay. Okay, got it. Did something happen to Baul? No, he's fine. I was just asking what it was like outside. How far along is the life-absorbing formula? Baul doesn't know anything about formulas. Yeah, I guess you're right. I told Baul to move around as he saw fit. We should move along too, right? Yeah, let's hurry. And all you gotta sing this song, Zoggy Zen, Zoggy Zen, let's go look at this. Zoggy was hopeless. Yeah, just think of all the things he could have done with all that energy. He finally found his equal, but the guy turned out to be his enemy. That's the saddest part of all this for him. Huh? Duke lost his friend and equal. Alexei never believed his equal even existed. Then there's Zoggy. The strong need strong friends to keep their power from distorting them. You think that's it? Take the Dom. He had his equal in Bellius, right? Raven, sometimes what you say goes right over my head. What? Are you making fun of my elegant, poetic comments? <laughs> you guys will be fine, though. You got plenty of friends. Yeah! Friendship! Da -da -da -da, it's friendship! You gotta go. I just realized that I'll be editing this on Sunday. So there's a chance that I might be able to beat the game in this record in this episode. I don't know. Because Sunday I'm not doing anything. I, I, I was thinking, I was thinking, you know, because, um, uh, my second, or not my second semester, but the spring semester of college, um, started yesterday. So I was thinking that since I have, like, classes, I'll be a little busy, so I won't have enough time to, um, like, edit, like, render out, like, an hour and 30 minute video, because that would take, like, 12 hours to render, but, because I'm, because I'd be editing it on Sunday, and Kratos' freaking Path of Radiance videos will be finished, so, oh, by the way, if you're interested in watching, uh, Kratos', 
for Path of Radiant series, I'll be sure to add an annotation right here, but, you know, those those videos take a lot of time to watch, so since those will be over, uh, stuff. Zoggy Part 2. Zoggy was about as annoying as they come, but I feel sort of sorry for him. Oh, that's surprising. I thought he was a huff, idiot kind of person. That is not what I sound like. I stand corrected. When you can do something better than anyone else, you wind up feeling like something's missing. The other researchers would go on and on about something I'd discovered, like, two months before. And I'd start to feel like talking with them was... pointless. So, you think Zoggy was the same way? I just got the feeling that we might have had something in common, that's all. But why am I telling you this? Just forget it. I'm sorry, but I have a good memory. Well then, keep it a secret, alright? <laughs> it's a deal. Why were we there back to back? Why were we there face to face? I have no idea why I randomly started singing. I bet, I bet, I bet, like, most of you guys think that's what my actual singing voice sounds like. Uh, it's not, actually. I wouldn't say that I'm a good singer. I would say that I'm actually relatively mediocre. But the singing, <laughs> anytime that you hear me singing on, uh, this channel, it's usually just me being intentionally goofy sounding. Like, I don't actually sound like that when I sing. It's just that I can't, I can't, even though I know that my singing isn't amazing, isn't really amazing, it's just that I can't actually sing good in front of people because I'm really self-conscious about that stuff, you know. So, I'm really self-conscious about my singing voice, so I tend to just sing badly on purpose. Let me get my drift. Limit bottle? No, thank you. Well, we're really maxed out on limit bottles, huh? What was that other thing that we picked up, by the way? I don't even know. We should have nine life bottles. Is this going to be the final boss? Who knows? I'm scared, ladies and gentlemen. Like, I'm legitimately nervous about this. What the? Oh. Because, like, the camera is so zoomed in on this guy, I thought he was a giganto monster. I was like, what the heck? Bowls? Hold on. What's this say? What's it? Hold on. Let's look at this first. Kala, kala, blah, 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 blah. Okay, that should be either for Estelle or... Nope, it's just a Yuri only sword, it looks like. Okay, yeah, sure. Um Bowl's on his own. It's been a long time since we first came here. I wonder if Bowl's taking good care of things in our absence. Or maybe he's tired of being in such a dark place and went home. Come on, Raven. He's at least more dependable than you are. If you kids are gonna say stuff like that to me, maybe I'll go back for real. Go ahead. But isn't it tough on Baul being near a magic field? Yes, the Baul of a few years ago might not have been able to withstand him. Even though he's young for an Intelikea, Baul has grown. I'm sure he's just fine right now. You really trust Baul, don't you, Judith? I wish Judith trusted me like that. Shut up, Raven. But you have to keep in mind that the Baul of a few years ago was significantly smaller than the current Baul. Really I mean, Baul might be really big now, but he didn't get that way until after we beat Nan and Tyson. You know, I believe that episode went out in October of 2014. Isn't that crazy to think that, you know, like, this series has been going on for so long? Like, it's been on, it's, it, like, honestly, like, it, it hasn't really felt like it's been going on for very long. It, it felt, like, it felt really short, you know? Like, it felt, it's one of those things, well, actually, I should, I should phrase that. It's one of those things that felt long, but because, but when you look back at it, it's, uh, you realize just how quickly time went by. It's kind of like, it's kind of like high school, you know? It's like, it's pro it's, this is probably something you probably really won't understand unless, like, you've actually graduated before. I was like, I remember someone, I remember during my sophomore year of high school, like, in band class of all places, like, one of my, there's like a senior person, a senior, one of my friends. Yeah, that was great! She mentioned, like, it was like, oh, it all went by so fast, and I was like, does it really, does it really feel like it, and I was like, and I was, remember thinking, I was like, does it really feel like it's gonna go that fast? I don't even, that's probably not the best way to phrase that, but I was like, does it really go by that fast? I was wondering. And then, once I became a senior in high school and I was ready to graduate, I realized, yes, it actually does go by really, well, like I said, at least one of those things that it doesn't feel like it's going back fast, but when you look back at it, you realize just how quickly time went by. I'm sure I'm going to finish, I'm going to finish this, I'm going to experience the same things now that I'm in college. I mean, heck, I'm already in the second semester of my second year of college, it's, it's kind of crazy to believe. Actually. The sign of victory. Yeah. Yay! All right. Still technically not quite. You know, yesterday actually was the coming of age ceremony in Japan. For those of you who don't know, 
Uh, at least yesterday at the time of recording this, which is yesterday, January 12th. The second Monday, the second Monday of, uh, this way that we're supposed to go, so what what was going, what was downstairs? The second Monday of every January, all people who were born, but who, all people who turned 20 between the April of the previous year and April of the current year, they have, like, a coming of age ceremony. Even though I turn, even though I turned 20 in September, I turned 20 this year. I'm not. Part, I won't be part of the coming of age ceremony. I, I mean, obviously, I wouldn't be part of it anyway because I'm American. But you know, regardless, I mean, you never know. Like, for all I know, really enjoy these little times together. for all I know, I could be freaking studying abroad in Japan next year. Kind of like the YouTube channel abroad in Japan. <laughs> I don't know. I it's like I. I honestly, I don't really have too many super concrete plans for the future because honestly, I have no idea where I'll be. I have no idea where I'll, where I'll be, let alone a year from now, like, not even two years from now, it's like, I just don't, I just don't know, I, I still, I still don't even know what I really want to do in life, but, you know, I shouldn't be talking about this stuff, because I feel like this might be good, this might be getting too cutting, I don't know, too close to home for some people watching, and they probably want to forget about stuff like that, so, um, Vesperia! I don't know, what the hell am I doing? <laughs> Oh yes, that's so much better. <gasps> yeah, that's so much better. <laughs> I'm sure you guys definitely want to hear me just stop. Like, what the hell was that? <laughs> Jeez, cheese and rice, man. I'm so freaking crazy. <sighs> I actually got a little lightheaded from that, just being so freaking stupid. Like, what the hell, man? All right, we're gonna kick your ass, boy. Get over here. I have no idea what accent I'm doing right now, I just know that I must fight you! Tonight we fight! For our freedom! And the stuff, I don't know. I feel like an easy win. Don't get Are you sure, Rita? Don't yeah, as just as uh, Rita said, don't- or just as Estelle said, don't get cocky, Rita. Is that the best you can do? No, it's not the best they can do. Clearly the best is yet to come, like the Michael Bublé song. I'm gonna shut up now. <clears throat> Whatever the case would be, nurse. Yeah, actually, I haven't gotten into really ramble territory at all in this recording session, which is kind of crazy. I've been pretty game heavy. My commentary has been pretty game heavy, pretty game heavy, which is actually kind of crazy. I guess it's because stuff is actually happening in this recording session. Like, um, you know, we just fought Zoggy. Depending on how, depending on if we meet Duke with by the 40 minute mark and if we, and how quickly we beat him, this might be the last episode of the recording session, who knows. I don't think that I managed to land a fatal strike on him, no I didn't. There we go. That was easy! You're way too excited. Le level, what the heck, level, level up for Raven. What the heck was that, level, that's, I don't even, what even accent would that even, what accent would that even be considered? Level, level up. Yeah, I don't know. Level up. Let's go ahead and fight you. Focus on the enemy in front. Down in front. You get it? No, I don't get it either. Sometimes I just say stuff and I'm like, and I just randomly say get it because I don't know. I don't know. It's like <laughs> sometimes I feel like some of the stuff I say could actually be taken as a joke. So like I just say get it, and so then someone's like, oh, haha, ha, I do get it, even though I have no idea what I'm talking about. I just, I just, so that means that whatever joke you got from that was just something that completely came from your head. How crazy would that be? Okay, I'm gonna fight you first since you're going straight for Estelle like a jerk. Don't you, we need to protect her while she's casting, you know. Stone Slash, Bone Bash. Bone Bash, that actually sounds like that could be a move. Bone Bash! I don't know. Oh, Blade of Noble Light, overpower even indestructible evil! Oh wow! I was that was that was that was pure coincidence, ladies and gentlemen. That was pure coincidence. Where's the still? Oh, I'm stone too. Okay, I'll have uh, Judith. We'll have you use a stone bottle on me, please. Uh, where are the stone bottles? There they are. Okay, stone bottle on me. There we go. Now I'm going to do a nice recovery smash on the still. Hey, look her. At least her wand was still purple. Like it wasn't stone. That's, that's not really like purple, it's like a pink magenta color. Whatever it gets to be. We're gonna be completely out of apple deals by the time the boss comes. Which means we're gonna have to start going into like more... 
like app like pineapple gel like I, I didn't mention this lemon gels actually I didn't mention this um I, I mean I tried talking about this previous in the previous recording session but I didn't really get a chance but I sort of interrupted myself it's like I feel like I'm gonna I, I like I'm developing like this too much of a good thing thing with uh lemon gels where it's like because apple gels like they're it's like I shouldn't just waste up. I shouldn't just waste my apple gels because if I use up all my apple gels, then um, because like I, I keep I keep saying, oh, I need to save my apple. I need to save my lemon gels for when I actually do need them. But if I use up all my apple gels, I'll have no choice but to use my my lemon gels to heal myself. In that case, when and that means even if I don't really, I mean, I guess the way to counteract that would be to just only use lemon gels when you absolutely need to, but at the same time, I don't like getting putting myself into situations where I actually have to use a lemon gel, because usually when you have to use a lemon gel, you're like two hits away from dying, so that's why I don't like doing stuff like that, but you know, overpower even indestructible, like I said, like when I, when I was doing, when I had, when I was saying uh, blade roll and like Rita said at the same exact time, you know, that, that was just synergy, you know, like you know, we're just, we're just, we're just that connection, you know, like, me and Rita, we're like the same person, you know, so, you know, that actually, that wasn't on purpose, I didn't actually know that she was about to do uh, Blade Roll, I just felt like saying it, because I hadn't said the chant for Blade Roll in quite some time, that's sort of become a Mega Shadow Fist original thing, saying Blade Roll all the time, I said it quite a few times in Bayonetta, <laughs> for whatever reason, whatever it to be, Champagne, Lagging Lupper, First Aid, you are all out of TP, lady. Yay! Friendship and hard work do win. Repeat leveled up. What are we gonna do, ladies and gentlemen? What are we gonna do? Okay, so we have to go in the other way. Hmm. Oh my God! Blastoise! Blastoise! Okay. This is this is really creeping me out though. <clears throat> really. So can we just go all out? This lack of music is just like, hey, you're about to fight the final boss. You're about to fight the final boss, so you better you better fight. I don't know. You better prepare yourself, is what I should say. Yeah, you know, it's just one of those things. You know, actually, I actually am starting to get into really ramble territory now. But one thing that you know, you know, one thing I find weird sometimes is like when I say something like out loud but like I'll say it like when I'm not when I'm not recording but I'll say it like as if I were recording I don't even know if I'm making it so, let, so let's say so let's say that I don't know I have like to like I don't know refresh the page on my browser or something I don't know just just this is just something random like I'm just like let's say I'm surfing the internet I'm like, oh, I need to refresh my page sometimes I'll be like sometimes I'll say out loud oh I just need to oh it looks like I need to refresh my page but then, but then to make it even crazier, I'll just be like, but then to make it even crazier, sometimes I'll accidentally say, I'll accidentally add ladies and gentlemen to it. Like, I'll be like, oh, it looks like I have to refresh my print. Oh, it looks like I'll have to. Sign of victory. I'm even stronger now. <laughs> oh, I'll have to refresh my page, ladies and gentlemen. Like, even though no one's, even though I'm not recording and no one can hear it. It's kind of, I know. I, feel like an easy I remember when I was recording, um. Smash Bros. actually with uh, Garkon and Karatus. Well, this is after we finished our recording session of Brawl. Like, we were, we, we were just doing like random matches for no reason. Um, one of them, I'm not gonna say who, but one of them was like, oh, looks like I'm about to lose everyone even though no one is freaking watching. There's just stuff like that. It's weird. It's something that you can only really understand if you do videos yourself. I will win! Oh, creatures, come forth! Revitalize! Or something. I don't know what she says, actually, right there. But when do I ever know? That's a good question. Alright. What is she about to do now? Healing circle? That is actually a little bit on the pointless side, actually, I still. I said actually twice in that sentence. I don't know why I do that. Was it great, Carol? I don't think it was great. But if you disagree, well, yeah, I'm not gonna complain. Whoa! I actually didn't want to do that. I mean, I did want to do that, but I didn't know that I was gonna do. Whoa, dude! This is like freaking crashed to insanity right now. Pineapple gel, lemon gel. Mm, is there anybody that actually needs lemon gel, pineapple gel, or either? No one really needs it. I guess what I could do actually is use a pineapple gel on Estelle and then pick up one of the pineapple gels. 
There we go. Do you want to pick up the item? No, not yet. What's over here then? That's the way that we're supposed to go. What's over here? Oh, there's another path. Interesting. All right, let's fight you. Watch my back. We haven't fought like these go golem type things. What are they called? I think they're just called go oh hammer golem. We haven't fought those guys since I think Shiko's ruins. It's actually kind of crazy to think. We we haven't fought enemies like this in Shiko's ruins. Whoa, man, Shiko's. I don't know where I'm going with this. Just shut up, Mega. You're being stupid right now. Yeah, but yeah, I, I'm sure that we fought them at least once or twice after this. But the last time that I remember that I distinctly remember fighting them was in Shiko's ruins. But then again, that possibly could be because you know someone's taking the time to watch from the beginning and they've been commenting on all their videos. And the most recent time that I've seen them was when I saw was when I was like reviewing like the comment that someone mentioned that someone made on one of the videos that I did while while in Shiko's ruins. That's that's also a possibility. Oh, well, let's go ahead and beat you up. And beat up the... Ow, that kind of hurt, dude. Oh, she just died. How many life bottles do we have? Oh, no. There we go. I should have actually just let Estella do uh, resurrection, but she probably wasn't going to do resurrection. She just did healing circle. There we go. Let's go. Let's go, indeed. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay. And what does this lead to? Okay, I, I, I'm sort of not liking this whole choose your own adventure, choose your own adventure layout here. So I don't know which way I'm supposed to go. So I don't want to end up going like down the path that I'm supposed to go, and then end up. Oh, this doesn't lead. Okay, no, never mind. So, oh, this doesn't lead to anything. Yes, it does. Okay, let's fight you. I feel like an easy win. Don't get caught. All right. <clears throat> so I think I'm gonna make this video an hour long if I get to Duke within that hour I doubt it, but if I do then we'll probably just beat the game in this video Maybe who knows if not we'll probably have about one more one or two more videos left before the game is over We'll probably just Probably like the thing is like if I get to Duke. I wouldn't want to just do like a 20 minute video I, I, I Like I wouldn't want the second to last video to be the longest video so like to be like soup to be very much longer than the final video. Like, the final video shouldn't be the shortest video of a game. It should be, it shouldn't be, I don't think it should really exactly be the longest either. I mean, it can be, I don't think that it exactly has to be, but the final video definitely shouldn't be, like, a norm, the length of a normal video. I mean, sometimes they are. I've, I've done videos, final videos. I've done final videos of uh, games that were, you know, the length of uh, a normal of that were the length of a normal episode, but you know, those are few and far between. Okay, let's see what we got here. Panacea balls, we definitely don't need those. What does this do? I see. I'm really not liking the way this is set up. Because, because this is set up in such a, a labyrinthy style, labyrinthy style, every time this happens, like, I, I feel like, I feel like I can't move. Like, because Nor normally you can't move, and then, like, I, I'm waiting, I, I guess I just wait for, like, the screen to flicker to let me know that I can move, but it doesn't do that, so I keep forgetting that, like, I can sort of just move, like, automatic. Anyway, whatever! I'm not even making any sense right now. Whatever. Really enjoy these little times together. But because it's set up in such a labyrinthy style, it's making me just want to just go straight to the end, and I don't want to do that because I don't want to miss out on any of this valuable experience that I'm definitely going to need for Duke, because he's probably going to be, like, level 1 million by the time... If we get to this final form, I don't know. Do the, do the, do, does each phase get like stronger? Like that's probably a stupid question. I was about to say, does like each phase get, is like each phase more powerful than the other, or or is it just like, or does it just have like a new? I mean, it might not just be a stupid question. It's like, I wonder, does each? I wonder if each phase is like technically stronger than the previous one, or if it's just like more annoying, as in it just gets more like cheap moves. I don't know. Who knows? Oh, brilliant angels! Grant us your favor. I either way, it, this isn't gonna be like Dragon Ball Z, where like, like, like we can we can beat the first bye bye. phase of Duke no problem. But by the time he gets to his final form, he's grown so exponentially stronger that we need to go Super Saiyan in order to beat him. It's not gonna be like that. More Super Saiyan two in Cell's case. Hey, don't hit me with that garbage, man! Man, what a bunch of jokers! Okay, let's beat you up. <clears throat> Block. 
I can't even see myself right now. <laughs> Stupid Blastoise. What are they actually called? Uh, Kanosal. Whatever the case would be. Let's go ahead and beat up these golems. Stone Golem! Stone Golem, he's the Stone Golem. Stone Golem, he's the Stone Golem. Stone Golem, he's the Stone Golem. Don't you mess with the Stone Golem. That was easy. You're way too You like that? That was like my imitation of like 1960s Motown music. That probably doesn't even sound very much like 1960s Motown music. I don't care. It doesn't matter. You know why it doesn't matter? Because I needed to get a drink of water. I haven't taken a drink of water in quite some time. Alright, let's fight you. <clears throat> this looks it was, I find it rather, rather ironic that my voice didn't get like really rough until after I drank some water. I was like, okay, I'm just going to take some water. And then I was like, alright, let's fight you. Like, that, that's not how it works. It should be the other way around. <laughs> alright, let's fight you since you're closer. Tidal Wave, by the way. Crescent Moon and stuff is also pretty good. The game, I think the game just slowed down for a second. Did it? Maybe it did. It does that sometimes. You know, PCs aren't the only things that have, like, slowdown. You can have lag in console games, too. It's just that games that games are made for con games that are made for consoles are made specifically with the console specs in mind. Not PC, where the specs could be very variable. So, it's very rare, it's, so it's a lot more rare to see lag in console games and PC games, but it does exist. Whatever case it would be. All right, here we go. Yay! Mm-hmm. Yay. Rune jacket. That should be the way that was set up. I want to say that was an Estelle item. Mm-hmm. And it's good. I wonder if anybody else can wear the rare protector. Nope. Nope. Yep. Oh, yeah, Raven can. I forgot that Raven and Restelle can sometimes wear the same weapon. Is Raven wearing a rare protector? I think he is. <coughs> yes, he is. Alright. Shoot this. What does that do for me? What does that do for me? I don't know. I guess I had to go down this path anyway, even if I wanted to avoid it. <sighs> Let's go down this path. That has like five panacea balls, which I don't need. All right, let's fight you. I have been trained by knights. I won't lose. Are you sure about that, Estelle? Because I've been trained by knights too, but I have lost several times before. No, I haven't been trained by knights. Or have I? Who knows? For all you, you don't know what you don't know what Carol's backstory is. Well, I mean, we've been we've known bits and pieces of it, but you know, for all you know, Carol could have been a Carol could have been a, a knight. You really do need a lemon gel. Like, this is one of those cases where you actually do need one. Okay. Heal yourself, please. There we go. Okay. Ow! Don't hurt me! Hey, don't touch me there. Where's the orange gel? There we go. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and break you, and lake you, and stake you, and crake you. I don't know where I was going with that. Hmm. Anywho! Let's go ahead and break this and lake this. What am I doing right now? Break and lake? Why? What is my obsession with rhyming break with lake? And actually, it's a secret. I'm rhyming dragon upper with lagon upper. Those aren't even, I mean, they are the rhymes. It's just that lagon leper isn't a word, at least to the best of my ability, to the best of my knowledge. I shouldn't say the best of my ability, because that wouldn't make very much sense in this situation. All right, looks like we're going to have to go the other way now. So maybe this isn't exactly quite choose your own adventure style as I thought it was going to be. I think I had to go that way for something, maybe. Okay, let's fight you, even though I didn't want to, but whatever. I need your EXP anyway. Give me your life forces, or I will be forced to eat you. In which case, I'd be getting your life forces anyway. See? Okay! I need... Never mind. I was about to say I need to do a nice recovery... Or, yeah, a not a nice recovery smash, a nice healing smash, but it doesn't look like I need to do that. Spread zero... I want to be able to get that healing arch charge, whatever it is. Part of me wants to just equip the Mjolnir and get the healing arch charge and then to learn that and then equip the stronger item later. Kind of like what I was planning to do with uh, the uh, Mjolnir plus one alpha after I learned... Oh, thanks for hitting, doing revitalize, revitalize right after while I was outside of the circle. I don't know, but I don't know. 
I don't know, is Healing Arts Charge really that necessary? It might be, who knows. Heart first aid, Lurse Laid. Yat, yat. Yak, yak, yak. Holy Lower, Lowly. First Laid. What is. I don't know, I like saying L so much. Just one of those things. You're dead. Okay. I, I'm secretly hoping that there's some, like, ancient, you know, shop. Like, there's, there, like, the Surveyor's Guild was secretly going in here on an expedition to get some research, to get some resources, and I'll have to be able to buy something from them. Because... I feel like an easy win. It actually seems kind of unfair to have us go through all of this and not be able to buy stuff. But, you th but then again, we've gone through some pretty long dungeons before without the ability to buy stuff. <laughs> Zafia or not Zafius, but uh Zalde comes to mind. Okay, let's I wanna beat the uh turtle things first, the Kassoons, the the Kanoso. Okay, die! Okay, never mind. Okay, get up so I can do a dragon upper on you. Now let's do a fatal strike. Let's break the uh, let's beat the other Kanoso. There you go. Uh, still you need uh, an orange gel or some sort. Let's get you an orange gel. What? <clears throat> There we go. Now you have some TP. So now you're not now you're not going to be stupid and get in the battle zone. Get in the zone, auto zone. Ow. Of course, I would you know, I should probably kill these guys first since they're attacking me. Yes, I'm glad we're still alive. Stop hitting me with your freaking goddamn licking. I don't even know where I'm going anymore. You're stupid freaking stinger. Just because you're the scorpion king doesn't mean you have the ability to be the rock. You see? I don't even know where I was going with that. Was did Estelle really cast a revitalize even though she was outside of the circle? Oh, it's because she's gonna do that. I see. New healing circle on herself. She doesn't really make much sense. She could. She should just do first aid because if she's just gonna. She's just gonna. If she's just gonna heal herself, she should do first aid because then she'll, you know, she'll probably get just as much TP. Maybe I don't know. And she'll only. And she'll be using. Oh, she'll probably. Get, she'll probably be getting just as much HP, and she'll be healing herself. Only, thus using less TP. You see how this works, ladies and gentlemen? I don't know. I don't I actually don't know how much health you get when with healing circle compared to first aid. I'll probably have to check. Anywho, first aid. Did she just do first aid on herself? That might just tell me just how little first aid actually health first aid actually gives you. You know. When you think about it, Estelle was actually a pretty useless healer during the beginning of the game. Like she was, she was pretty, she was pretty useful at times. Like if it wasn't for her, I probably wouldn't have been able to beat Zoggy during the beginning. Oh, well, I would have eventually, but it would, it would have taken a lot longer to beat Zoggy than it did in the beginning of the game. But at the same time, it was like at the same time, like the only healing art that you knew at the very beginning of the game was first aid. So once we got more people into the party, it started getting a little, it started getting a little ridiculous. I was really glad when she learned nurse. I knew that she was going to, though, because, I mean, it just makes sense, like, Nurse was in Attorney and Symphonia, so I have no idea why, why it wouldn't be in this game. What's down here? Is there anything down here? We can't even go down that path, it looks like. What's over here? So, is this the way that we're supposed to go? I don't know. Hold on. Hold on to that thought. Okay, we came this way. Okay, what happens if I hit this? Okay. I don't know what that does for me. Oh, that raises that. Oh, that allows me to go back this way, but we've already been there. You can see that as the chest has been opened, so we're not going to go that way again. All right. So this is the way that we're supposed to go. So let's go ahead and fight you. Let <clears throat> me drink some water, by the way. Ugh. All right. So I feel like I'm starting to get a little bit too repetitive in the commentary section, just talking about the game for too much. So let's see. Is there any topic that I want to talk about? Normally, normally I go into videos with like a list of topics. I don't have, I don't like write down a list of topics because like that would be really pointless. Because you never know. Like for what, like I could write down like five topics and then I'll only talk about one of them because I ramble too much. You never know. But usually I come, usually I come into episodes with at least something in mind because I, because sometimes I feel like just talking about the game for, because you know, like. A commentary of a game is a commentary of a game, so the majority of the commentary should be about the game. But, you know, I feel like I should at least add in some type of... Some some type of something... some Something to make it just a little bit more, you know... to Just to differentiate it from all the other Tales of Vesperia walkthroughs that you'll be seeing. Because there are plenty of them. 
Not as much as you may think, but there are still plenty, and some are even being uploaded to this very day. Not including mine. Not including mine. Okay. Of course, you know, I'm saying, of course I'm saying this up until this very day, uh, the time of the recording this, for all I know. We'll, we'll use one Miracle Gel on Estelle. Where is it? Uh, Miracle Gel. For a second, I thought that I thought that Estelle was actually using the Miracle Gel so that, without me even realizing it. There we go. Discard those. Shoot this. What does that do for me? Okay. <clears throat> if you want to be a Joker, you guys have to be a Loker. I don't know. What does that do for me, though? I don't like the ones where they don't show you where it goes. We've already been through all of this, haven't we? I don't know where else to go. We have. Oh, I didn't even know we could walk across that. What's over here? We've been here before, haven't we? I'm sure we have. Alright, so. Hmm, we've been down here before. Is there any other path that I missed? No, I don't think so. Alright, so. Now we just need to figure out how. Okay, so let's go this way. I'm gonna try to avoid this guy if I find him. I find him. If I don't, I don't. <clears throat> um, cause I really just wanna. Get, I just wanna get out of here right now. Panacea. Okay, so we we just did a. We just went full circle. So, what exactly does this do for me though? That doesn't do anything. I can't. That, like this doesn't lead anywhere. Or does it? Yes, it does. But we've been down there before. Hmm. Where to go? Where to go? Where to go? Where to go? It's like these these fights are starting to get a little on my nerves right now because I just want to. What we need is to find one that will drop this down and that will get me that'll get me to where I need to go. I think. But we've hit everything. What have I missed? Ah, uh, shoot you! Get you out of the way. I'll fight. I might. I might fight you on my way back. I don't know. Hmm. Oh, this is new. Empress dress. Let's see who that's used for. Estelle, maybe? I would say so. No, doesn't look like it. Oh, it's this one. Body. No. There we go. <clears throat> Let's fight you. Focus on the enemy in front. Focus on the enemy in front. You see what I did there? I'm sure you did. Ugh. Well, yeah, but anyway, let's talk. Let's 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 think of a topic to do because I feel like I'm starting to get just a little bit too repetitive here. So. Topics! Topics! I already had my whole anime spiel last- <gasps> I can finally talk about that topic that, like, this is something I wanted to talk about in an episode of Ace Attorney, but I didn't get a chance to. And then I, then I tried mentioning it in this- in the previous recording session, but I didn't- but I for, I sort of forgot to. And it's, you know, I remember one time in Ace Attorney, I was like- I was like, I need to get as much evidence as I can, because I don't want to be like those people who- Uh, who are- people who go to, like, concerts for, like, uh- People go to like J-pop concerts who only know like the lyrics to like a song, who like the TV-sized version of a song. Cause like, okay, so here it is. So for those of you who don't know, like here in the U.S., usually like when we make like openings for like TV shows and whatnot, we tend to like make songs specifically. We tend to make songs specifically for the TV show. Like it's um, I mean some yeah, we generally, we generally just make sh songs specifically for the TV show. Like it's not like life and song. It's not like licensed songs made by, you know, you know, just some J-pop artist or J-rock band or whatever. Um, that's not, that's, that's generally not the case in anime, for example. Like, sometimes, sometimes they, they do, they do hire, like, J-pop artists to make songs specifically for the, um, for the anime, but that's not always the case. I still don't feel like, okay, never mind. Sorry, but you're going bye-bye. <clears throat> but that's not always the case. Um, so, but yeah, so, usually what they'll do is, like, they'll, like, an artist will make, like, a single, and then, like, mm, I'm still not, I'm still not exactly too sure about the technicalities behind this, actually, so, uh, you might need to look up some more, some better information than me, but yeah, they'll get, like, licensed songs by an artist, and they'll, and usually they'll have the artist make, like, a tv size the TV, a tv size version, a TV sized version of a song. Usually a song a TV sized version of a song is just like the first half of it, the first minute and thirty seconds of it. And then um Yeah, there we now we can go this way. <clears throat> and so usually you can and usually like those J pop artists and whatnot, they're like actual singers, they're not like people made specifically for a 
general for like the anime. So they'll have they'll have like their own concerts and everything, right? So usually the people who go to those concerts are people who know them simply because of like a single that was used as a TV sized version of us was used as an opening for an anime. And because they but they the thing is they didn't bother memorizing the lyrics to um the full song. They only memorized the lyrics to like the TV sized version of the song. It gets kind of silly, like if you look at a concert by that person, like if it's a song that's used for as an opening for an anime, like you'll see everyone singing along to it for the first minute and 30 seconds. And then once you get to the other half, everyone just shuts up and it's just it's just a singer by themselves singing and it's actually kind of silly when you think about it because a relatively recent example is like I was, um, uh, Aoi A- I, should, I shouldn't say it in a Japanese accent, her name Aoi Air. Air. Um, she did the. She recently did an opening. She recently did the most. I was looking. I was trying to find her most recent single, which was um, Sunagato Omoi, which was used as an opening for some something. It was some variety show. But she also did uh, one single. Innocence was used as the second opening for the anime Sora Online, and the other single, uh, Ignite, was used as the first opening for Sora Online Two. So I couldn't find. I couldn't find uh, Sunagato Omoi on um, like the music video for it. I can only find like a live performance that she does, like this 20-minute video, and she and she sang the song in it. But um, she she I think she did like three, four songs. No, three songs. She started off with Innocence, then she went into Sunagaru Sunagaru Omoi, and then she finished off with Ignite. And for Innocence and Ignite, um, you know, like everyone was like singing along, like yeah. Yeah, all the freaking Mayo Zuni Ma! Or Mayo Watsu. Mayo Watsu Ni Ma! Ujun Tareke no Sekai o Sono Te De Uchi Hana Te! And then, and, but then after the first minute and 30 seconds happened, um, she freaking. Everyone just shut up! It was really silly! It was just like. Wow, you should at least take the time to learn the lyrics to the full song because, like, you should know that TV sized versions of songs are not the full song. For, like, anything, even if it was a song that's made specifically for an anime, usually they have, like, a full version of that song somewhere. You probably, generally speaking, you won't be able to hear it until about a month after the anime is finished. Oh boy! Ladies and gentlemen, what is, where does this take me? It's loped. But what about this one? It's locked. I wish that I could teleport to the beginning and buy some stuff. All right, we're going to do like one, maybe two. No! Come on, can I save, please? Seems like the top is just up there. Duke must be there too. This is the moment of truth. Is everybody ready? I've been ready. Let's do it. Yeah, we have to do this. Right. Even this old man's gonna put up a fight. People believe in us. They're waiting for us. We must defeat the Autophagos. For them! And for Pharaoh and Bellius. For the memories of the Intelikea. Let's go. Alright, I'm gonna give one... I'm gonna give one, maybe two attempts at this Duke fight. If I lose, then I'll just start another recording session later. I don't know. I don't want, the, I don't want this video to go on, like, super, super OP long of OPness. I don't know. I'm nervous, ladies and gentlemen. I really am. We're all level 63. Let's see our items. We have 11 lemon gels, 15 pineapple gels, and 8 orange gels. So we should be good on TP. So Estelle, so if we can get, we have 14. Estelle used a little miracle gel, didn't she? Or maybe I didn't just restart. Me, I didn't. Rest okay, we have a couple of treats. Oh, retreats rest uh, restores 30% of max HP for all party members. Oh, that's good. We have a, we have we have some stuff. How many life bottles do we have, by the way? We have eight life bottles. We have a little bit more than half of max, because mm, half would be seven and a half. All right, I'm gonna dry it. I saved. Wait, can we can we teleport back, please? Locked. There's Duke. You can see him way in the background over there. No, I didn't want to do that. I want to go to the other one. Oh well, who cares?
Duke, we have the four elemental spirits. Their power can counter the Autophagos. There's no need to use people to destroy the Autophagos. Look at its size. Four spirits are nothing against it. They're crucial. We'll make up the rest by turning the Blastia cores to spirits, too. Every single core in the world! And as a bonus, it'll put an end to the Blastia culture that you hate so much. Not too shabby, huh? I doubt humans will hand over their Blastia quietly. Or will you force them? Can you not believe that people can move forward and change? Humans will not let something go once it is in their grasp. So you won't listen. We will destroy the Autophagos our own way. Please, wait just a little longer. And will the world return to its former state? Huh? Will the air be controlled by the Entelechea? Will all life return to a time when nature ruled? No. You are changing this world, our Terca Lumeres. For what? For the convenience of humans. Nothing more. Can't you think that the world might be growing? I think of the Entelechea becoming spirits as evolution. Can't you see that? I would not presume to speak on the choices of the Entelechea. However, I also have my choices. So you won't listen to us because we're humans? You say you can't trust people, so you just drop everything. Then when it's too late, you try to wipe them out? Do you know what this tower is? Tarkaron was once a city, but the ancients turned it into a weapon to destroy the Antelikea. <sighs> to the ancients who did not recognize the threat of the Blastia, the Antelikea who attacked the Blastia were nothing more than a nuisance. And the air went out of balance, and the Autophagos appeared. Only then did humans listen to the words of the Antelikea. Our world has seen many sacrifices, yet humans committed the same offense, and they will again. Those who eat away and ruin this world, those who would change the world for their own continued existence, they are apostles of destruction greater than even the Atafagos. I made a vow to my friend that I would protect this world. The Lucifer. So Chroma told you. Yeah. She also told us to stop you. She listened to us, too, and became a spirit. So please, we can do this together. Enough. If the Entelikea would throw away their mission, then I will take it up. Zooming in on the sword, I wonder what that could mean. I need not wait for your method. Once I complete this formula, the world will be saved. Duke, stop! As long as humans rule, they will commit the same offense time and again. If that happens, their hearts will grow wild and the future will be even more painful. Even if that happens, it's the path we choose. Even if we are hurt or stopped, we can still walk again as long as we don't give up. She's right. You'll never find anything new if you're afraid of making mistakes, of failing. And unlike you, we haven't chosen this path on our own. Everyone decided on it. Yeah, going it alone might be tough. But we're not alone. If one person can't do it, then we do it together. I finally learned that we can walk together like that. That may be sufficient for those who are connected to one another. However, there will always be some who cannot accept a difficult future. You all surely understand that. It will be difficult, but that is reality. They will take what changes. Think and change again, both the people and the world. So even if it takes tens, hundreds of years, they will listen someday. I know this now. That's what it means to live. Right, there are things you have to protect, but this old man wants to see what lies ahead for people in the next era. See how the fools change for those who can't see them anymore. Humans prey upon this world. You cannot protect both. Things are different now. The world can change. That's what the spirit conversion is for. Ring a bell is playing in the background. The world may change, but its people will not. I cannot allow the world to change simply because humans will not change themselves. Then 
Echo can change. We may feel the same toward this world, but we will never see eye to eye. You leave me no choice. Come. This is auto scrolling, by the way. Oh no! Ah! Let me use. Uh, they're probably gonna have some pre-battle banter, so let me use my what call it? My uh, limit my uh, magic lens first. Resistant to nothing, weak to nothing. Level sixty, so we're stronger than him. But you know, should I tell you how many, how many, how many, how many forms I think I know he has at the bare minimum? No, I'll let it be a surprise. Oh, this lucky is gonna say anything. Okay. The Intellicaea, the Critia, they've chosen the same path. I have no reason to go along with your plan. Could you be any more stubborn? Why won't you listen? We're trying to create a new future, so we don't have to repeat a terrible past. The Intellicaea will regret that decision, and humans will wish they had died. I won't regret it, no matter what you say. We will keep on working to bring this hope to our future. Even if it means fighting for our lives. Such a foolish conclusion. There is no longer any point in talking. I thought we could get you to understand. I guess we can't change you. No more. All right. So the first po I don't think that the first form should be that big of a problem. I'm really nervous about the other forms, though. I don't know what they are, but I know that one of them is supposed to be really, really tough. I remember someone was like, how do I defeat this number form, insert number form here, of Duke? Okay, Fatal Strike. But he only has 200,000 XP, and we're two levels stronger than him, which doesn't really mean anything. I shouldn't really, we're three levels stronger than him, and it doesn't really mean anything, so I shouldn't really be going off of, off of levels alone, but, oh no, over limit, but guess what, Mitch? I can go into over limit too. Now I'm gonna kick your ass. I think. I don't know. Let me go. Let me go. For punishing beast smash. Burst dart. I actually wanted to use my altered art, but you know that's to be expected, I suppose. You're not gonna hurt me, buddy. I'm in level four. Okay, now I'm not in over limit to begin with. Let me use a nice recovery smash to get rid of that stupid physical element. All right. Oh, ow, I really cannot stand that freaking Deinomus. I think that's Deinomus, isn't it? Or was, I thought Deinomus was smaller than that. Maybe it's Deinomus level 3000. Because, you know, screw level 2 through 2,299. 2, 2, 2, we just go straight... Well, he's about to do some wind attack, it looks like. Where is he at now? Okay, well, he's about halfway there. Oh, I'm so nervous. Like, you guys have no idea how nervous I am about this fight. I legitimately do think I'm gonna have to do a grinding session for this. And... Ow, that hurts, that hurts, that hurts. Probably what I think I'm gonna do is if I lose, which probably I'm going to... I'm probably going to lose. I'm going to do... Um... A grinding session and then stock up on everything. Because I think that we just don't have enough life bottles to win, maybe. Who knows? Wait a minute, how did everyone get drops to t drop their TV so quickly? Like, we did a blue save station before this. Ugh, Estelle, Estelle, Estelle. If now is the time to use a frickin' orange gel, now would be the time. If there was ever, let me say this, if there was ever a time to use an orange gel, now would be the time, I should say. Recover. Okay, you can use an orange gel too. Actually, never mind, I was about to have her cancel it, because I was like, we should probably save those for our healing person, but oh well, whatever. Who cares? Rita should use an orange shell too, shouldn't she? But I'm not gonna make her. She's gonna have to do it out of her own free will. Because, honestly, the only person I'm gonna actually force into using an orange shell is... Okay, level 1 over limit is not gonna do anything for me. I'm just gonna stay, 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 run, 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 run. I'm gonna stay away from him. Because I do not want him to go in... Oh, revitalize, thank you. I don't want him to go into freaking Mystic Art OP mode. Okay, he's almost dead. I'm gonna wait for him to... I wonder if... No, because generally speaking, you can actually hurt bosses when they're in overlimit. I was, I was, one, I was wondering if maybe the final form of Duke has like can go into level four overlimit, where like we can't legit, we legitimately can't hurt him. Can I do nice recovery smash, please? Thank you. Whatever the case may be, I'm sure that he's got to have something that allows him to heal himself too, right? Maybe. Who knows? Holy power has come to me. First aid. Oh, you need, you need an orange shell. Uh, Estelle. There we go. 
we're gonna have to start going into like uh, things that recover that he'll. Okay, ow, that hurt. That hurt. Revitalize. I don't have any. I'm gonna use TP for myself too because I mean it make just makes sense. Okay. Not for healing purposes. Well, okay, you're dead. Now I know what Pharaoh saw in you. You'll never beat us. <laughs> How unfortunate. I wish our paths had crossed earlier. Perhaps we would have met now under different circumstances. Would you have agreed with the way we did things? No, it could never have worked. We have walked different paths from the very start. Then I guess we have to fight! The best path for an enduring world is to return it to its natural state. That is the path I chose. I will die for that. My friend, grant me your strength! This is Otis going, by the way. So I can't, like, just hit A and have it. It does that sometimes. <clears throat> oh, yep, we're gonna die. <laughs> we're gonna die. We're gonna die. Let me use another... Can I? Hold on. Yeah, it looks like I'm going to have to use another uh, life... Or not a, another life bottle, but another uh, limit... Not, another magic lens on him. Alright, resist to nothing, weak to nothing. Level 65! That was a 5... That means that the final boss is going to be level 70, huh? Probably. The final form. I shouldn't, I shouldn't go off of levels alone. But if I were to... I would say that we have a high chance of dying. How could the Entelikea agree to such an uncertain plan? It's not uncertain. We did it. The Entelikea became spirits. Using the spirits to defeat the Autophagos is not a fantasy. Your memories of him bind you. I feel sorry for you. All the people of the world decided this together. So get out of the way. So I am the only stubborn one? No. I am not mistaken. I should have used a nice healing smash on myself. Use all my power to eliminate your misguided purpose. Oh god, Rita's dead. Yeah, we're there's no way we're going to survive the next form. Is there a next form? I don't know. Oh, oh, he's an overlimit. This is freaking this is just fine and dandy. What is he at now? I just I don't I don't see us beating this form, ladies and gentlemen. I think we're I think I legitimately am but ow! Goodness, man! Stop! Is Estelle far enough away? I'm gonna have her. I think she's far enough away that she should be able to do resurrection. Okay, now you should be able to do resurrection. That way. She doesn't have enough TP. Yep. Alright, orange gel. I figured as much. Okay, please. Orange gel! Orange gel. <sighs> you know what? Screw it. <laughs> I I just don't understand anymore. I legitimately just don't understand why you didn't use your freaking orange gel. Okay. Now that that's going on, we're gonna have you cast resurrection on Rita. I'm gonna use a nice healing smash. Nice. Never mind. Yeah. And you know that whole resurrection thing was kind of pointless, wasn't it? Wasn't it? You know what? Life bottles up the wazoo. We're gonna lose. We are so gonna lose, ladies and gentlemen. Like, there's no way I'm getting out of this alive. I would be very surprised if I got out of this alive. Okay, so... I'm gonna have you use Resurrection again. Hold on. Full charge. Oh. Defend. Assemble. Moderate. What do I usually have it at? Let's just go with full charge. Sure. I don't know what that does. Exactly. Oh, she can't use a life bottle to begin I mean, she can't use Resurrection to begin with. Alright, we're going to have you use a life bottle. And then after that, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to give Estelle an orange gel. Actually, I'm going to give you... You really need this. I'll give you a pineapple gel. Give you a pineapple gel. And then... This might be stupid, but I think I want to use a treat. Let's use a treat. Alright, that didn't do shit. Well, I thought that was, was going to be a lot more dramatic of a health increase than... 
It actually was. Alrighty then, whatever. Where are you at now? 41. 410,000. The spell! Estelle, you know, if now is, if there's any time to waste your TP usage, now would be the time. Because this... Oh my goodness, man. I'm just... This is the second form, too. Ow! 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 This is... This just isn't fair. This just isn't... This is not fair. I mean, granted, I'm actually doing a lot better than I thought it was. It's just that I'm just really... Ugh. The next part, man. The next part is just going to be absolutely ridiculous. Oh, goodness, man. I am... I'm going to do a grinding session, ladies and gentlemen. Like, I think, anyway, because... There's no way I'm getting out of this alive. She has no TP again. That's lovely. You know, just wasting TP on useless stuff. You know, like, dispel when... Actually, no. People actually do have physical elements. Never mind. I have her set to attack strong enemies. That's why she's going to go to them when she doesn't have any... Whatchamacallit. Uh... Let's go with the Miracle Gel. Sure. Why not? Oh! No. No, maybe I should save him... Oh, now you're gonna use Resurrection. Good. Alright, and then she used a, an Apple Gel or something. I don't freaking know. Recover. Okay, oh crap! No! Stay still, man! If you just stood still, you'd be a lot easier to deal with, man. Let me use a... I don't think anyone needs to use a... Uh, whatchamacallit just yet. Let me use a Pineapple Gel on myself, because we're all out of Orange Gels, so... The spell, you're about to die, so we'll have you use a uh, lemon jelly, I suppose. Maybe. I don't know. I don't want to use up my life bottles. <clears throat> okay. Ow! Okay, we got down. He's a quarter down. <sighs> this is ridiculous. This is really, this is legitimately ridiculous, like, right now, ladies and gentlemen. Like, you have no idea how ridiculous this is. If I have to do a grinding session, I think that if... I think if we're lucky, we might be able to beat this form. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, no! Over limit! Now is the time to use... Now that I'm in level 3, now is the time to use a limit bottle. Wouldn't you agree, ladies and gentlemen? You probably don't agree, but I don't care. Okay, please. Okay, now I'm gonna go into over limit. Don't you dare do a freaking Mystic Art. Don't you dare use a Mystic Guard. I swear on me, Mom, if you use a Mystic Guard, I'm going to kick you in the butt. Oh, come on! What the heck? Why can't I do, like, any of my arts right now? I have a physical element on me that doesn't allow me to... Let me use a Panacea bottle on myself. That's probably going to kill me, isn't it, ladies and gentlemen? Let me use a Lemon, lemon Gel first. Okay, re re Judith is dead, so... Next, oh, it looks like she came back. Looks like someone used a life bottle on her. All right, what's next? Estelle, lemon gel. Ow. You have your health. Now, Estelle, pineapple gel. Okay, now that that's good. Now, me. Judith just died again. Now, me, panacea bottle. Where is it? Okay, that's good. Now, now, um, don't use a life bottle, please. It's LB. I'll be to cancel. Maybe I need to. Okay, there we go. Um, lemon gel. This is stupid. Now use resurrection. This might be a little bit on the stupid side. I think this is a little bit on the stupid side. I don't know. I just, it's just. You're kidding. It's just so ran- okay. I have to do it just the right second, I think. No. Um... She can't use anything right now. I think that's how that works. So... I think we lost this fight, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know. I am pretty sure that we lost. Alright, Miracle Gel, because I need a miracle to get the hell out of here in one piece. Yeah, don't mind Judith, she's just dead. Okay, Estelle's dead. How many life bottles do I have? One. Estelle! Okay, now, Estelle, resurrection, please. Oh, now you're in over limit. Now I'm dead. She brought back. Okay, yep. 
Yep. Yep, this is... This is over. It's, it's, it's over, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sorry. We're not getting out of this alive. Oh, well. Delight roll. Hmm. Maybe... Hmm. What level should I be... If I were to go off of another... Hmm. Okay. She brought back... Me? Sweet. Uh, we're, ha we're only halfway there, though, man. Uh, well, at least everybody's back. For now. Let me use a nice... I need to start being mindful of my own t HP, by the way. I'm pretty sure. You can't get away from this, ladies and gentlemen! You can't get away from this! You can't get away from this! Just no! Uh, I don't know what... He's gonna heal himself. What a sack of shit. Don't you dare cast first aid on yourself. You're already super OP as it is. Look, go on! <laughs> oh no! I wanted to... Okay. Please. Please come back from the, abyss of, from the abyss of death. Resurrection. Now, now, just, just do me... Never... Okay, we're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. Unless Rita and Judas somehow manage to do this. Uh, what I could do is just have her go into, like, level 4 over limit and just spam Tidal Wave, but that's kind of stupid. Uh, yep. Let's see how long she died. Uh, yep. Defeated! And they were never heard from again. Ugh, oh, goodness. And they were never heard from again. Oh, so now you're gonna say that, huh, Duke? What a frickin' jerk. Alright. Well, that was that. I said I was gonna. I said I was gonna give it two tries, but no, that's a little silly. I think what I'm gonna do next time, before next recording session, which will be the final recording session, definitely. I'm going to. I think I'm gonna grind. I have no idea how long I'm gonna grind for, though, because let's see, we're all level 63. Ooh, I don't know, man. I was like, maybe I should go to level 70 to be just as strong as potentially any other forms but um I don't know that's gonna take a long time it's gonna take like six hours to do because of level because of the level that we're at uh, oh no man I don't know but I think I'm gonna have to do that and then before I'm gonna stock up on all the items make sure I'm stocking up on everything and then I want to um, and then we'll take on Duke and hopefully beat him in the next recording session. That sounds like a plan. So, anyway, sorry for the disappointing stuff. If you like this video, the series of videos, please feel free to leave a like. If that was cool, please feel free to subscribe and join the Elven, Bro Elven Brother here today. Also, follow me on Twitter, twitter.com forward slash Mega Shadow Fist. So be sure to leave that in the description. Thank, thank you guys so much for watching. This is Mega, Sh Mega Shadow Fist signing out. Bye!